this summer, French second division champions Monaco spent an amazing $235 million on new players, including Radamel Falcao, Jean Moutinho, James Rodriguez, Eric Abadal and the veteran defender Ricardo Carvalho as well. The move seems to have paid off as they are top of Ligue 1. Andy Mays being to meet Carvalho in his hometown of Monte Carlo. I live in Monte Carlo and this is, is great. It's beautiful. <laughs> Here is beautiful, it's, it's quiet also. Of course, um, it's always important also to do our work like a professional. It's, it's, it's important for us to feel like uh, you are doing well because after that you enjoy a little bit more the city. The, the, the city is, 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 is amazing, it's, it's so beautiful. You can, you can walk uh, in the streets, easy, you can have a coffee, it's, it's, it's very good to, to, to live here. After I left, uh, I finished my contract with Real Madrid. I was feeling fit still to play. Uh, I would like to, to try an uh, Italian league or a French league, so it's good for me to be close also to, to my family and I feel fit to help my teammates. I had uh, odd, other offers, uh, even the, from Premier League clubs, but uh, I think my cycle was in Chelsea. I was so proud to play for Chelsea, so I would try to, uh, another, another league. So you wouldn't have been able to go back and play for another team in the Premier League? Mm, I don't think so. Uh, I don't think so. I had uh, my great years in, in Chelsea. I like the club. Uh, it's a special club for me. and. Um, I had offers, the, you talk about uh, another uh, Premier League clubs, but um, my, in my mind was like, I play in England, I play in Chelsea, I spent six years there, so uh, I would prefer to go in a, another league. It's not easy because the club is just, just coming from the, the second division, but uh, you grow, you are growing as a team. Of course, you are winning also. It's important for the team to get confidence and to grow. And also, you got uh, good players as well. We have Falcão, we have Moutinho, we have James. They are quality players. And uh, myself, uh, you got uh, Abidal. You got, uh, in, in the end, you got a good, a, good, a good spirit inside the rest room. And of course, you got quality. Uh, but it's not easy to, to grow. Uh, especially the club is coming from second, second division. You are doing well. Uh, but of course, we want to grow more and uh, the team wants to improve. Everyone knows the Paris Saint-Germain is favorite. They got the team already. They won last year and they, they, they did very well. They got the great players as well in, in the squad. But uh, you want to, to try to, to win also the, the, the French League. Uh, but more than that, it's important for the club to get like, uh, the access for the Champions League draw. It's so important. Is it strange playing with Eric Abidal, obviously a former Barcelona player in defence? He's, he's your main man, isn't he, now, in the team? I'm happy because, like me, and when I come here, it would be easy to go to Qatar or Dubai or America. But uh, Abidal is, is the same. If he's, he's, he's fit in the end, he's fit and he's, he has quality in his, in his, in his game. But of course, last year, Last year and the last two, three years, of course, you were a little bit enemies, but uh, outside of the pitch, you, we, you speak and you normally, just inside, everyone has to fight for, for his team. He's an honest coach, he's, he, he works a lot also in, in the pitch, he's honest with ev everyone and he, he's, he's the, the coach he likes to work. And he likes always to, to win, uh, win the games. He, he knows it's important for the club to grow. So he's doing very well. I hope you carry on to, to winning our games because in the end, uh, everyone will be happy.